something difficult uh, to get out of is the purity spiral, where if things aren't exactly perfect as they need to be at the moment, you just give up. You know, there are some really good reformed Christians who won't participate in the American government because of um, they view it as illegitimate. But there's, an, there's a verse in Ecclesiastes that says, don't be too righteous and don't be too unrighteous. And the idea there is um, life is balance and there is wisdom in moderation. And yes, God is holy. He desires us to be pure. Um, but we live in a fallen world, and um, sometimes you, you are interacting, not sometimes, most of the times, in places where even Paul says in the world there are all sorts of immoralities and, and evils, and we're to judge the church, first of all, and leave the judgment of the world to God, and yeah, we're going to interact in the world, in the marketplace, in, in the business world, and in politics, and, it, and in politics you have a, a, a just basically a choice between options and none of them are ideal and the power is going to be distributed somewhere um, people are going to be ruled um, because power doesn't go away and power is not neutral and so as a Christian make the wisest choice that you can um, A.D. Robles made a, a similar video about this topic and he points out the parable of uh, the Lord who, or the master who gives different servants different amounts of talents and uh, you know, one had five, one had ten, one had one. And the guy who had one talent, you know, buries it, doesn't do anything with it because he says, I knew you were a severe master. And so I buried it and here it is, just that same one you gave me. Um, well, we're probably in a time as Christians where, politically speaking, uh, culturally speaking, we have one talent. Uh, we don't have ten. We don't have five. We have one, uh, at least here in America. And that doesn't mean don't do anything. That doesn't mean bury it and, you know, hide out and... Um, do nothing it means be faithful with the one be real realistic where we are at um and uh, yes be holy yes be uh, obedient to god but as according to ecclesiastes um don't weary yourself in this fall pers false pursuit of being too righteous now of course don't be too unrighteous um but follow the lord uh eat and drink fear god be merry uh, take value and meaning in the work of your hands. And yeah, we, we live in strange, strange, messed up times. Yeah. But with the one talent that you have, be as faithful as possible. God bless.